bow tie? Where's your tie? Like daddy. Let's see. Can I see your tie? Show mommy your tie. Can you say cheese? No, daddy's giving you your water. Say thanks, dad. Alright, I'll see you guys over there. Okay. Will you have everything? I think so. Okay, he's got his jacket, his vest, he's here. Yeah, All he right. doesn't need lunch. Alright. Alright, we'll see you in a bit. Alright. All right. Let me close the door. So it's not loud. Come. Huh? Okay. All right, good morning. We are scrambling per usual. Uh, what else is new? Daddy, come on. We is driving separately, baby. We're going to James's Christmas performance, so we got to go now. We're supposed to be there right now, but it's fine. Um, so we're going to go and see James sing, and then he has to go get his staple removed. I don't know if I mentioned on here, but he hit his head on the nightstand and had to get a staple in his head. So we're going to the doctor to get that removed, and then we might go to the mall to go see someone if we can there's like a waiting list online um so i don't know if we'll get in to see that person but if not we can still there's like a train that he can ride and fun stuff to do so after the doctors we'll do something fun right buddy right let's see your cute little outfit are you eating your waffle sorry it's hard to adjust your little bow tie. You look so cute. Should we go to school? All right, let's go. He's with Miss Janet. So we just finished at the doctor's and I asked James, whoa, I asked James if he wanted to go to see Santa or if he wanted to go home and he said go home. So I really do, tomorrow is his last day of school before Christmas, so I need to get his teacher gifts together. He has five teachers that I'm giving gifts to, so honestly... I could probably use the extra time at home and if he just wants to go home he handled the staple removal like a champ how you doing bud good good you, you, you want to go home do you want to go home bud okay so we're gonna go home I was thinking about possibly ending or not ending the vlog but stopping the vlog for today what, babe? Stopping the vlog for today and then just continuing it tomorrow. Um, what are we doing tomorrow? I don't remember. But anyway, um, I was going to potentially just end it here. But I might show you the teacher gifts as I assemble those. So, we will see. Is he yummy, bub? Let me see the face. Show mommy the face. Can you show it to mommy? It's so cute. Is it yummy? Take a bite. <laughs> Let's see, take a bite. So I had a um, coffee this morning when I got up, but I haven't had, I wanted a Starbucks. And so I went and got a Starbucks and I got James one of these. Isn't this so cute? So cute. So he's eating his, I got one too, just because I wanted to try it. Oh, I can't, can't do this. Too many things, too many things. Let's see, buddy, how is it? Uh -oh. You have a runny nose, I gotta get it. Is it yummy? Rabbit. What happened? Rabbit in the hinge. Oh, you want me to wipe it? Okay, we'll wipe it. I am on my way, I'm in motion. Let's go to the ocean. Yeah, let's go out. can hang out on the beach without freezing yeah isn't that amazing in christmas times we'll be chilling and having a good good time doesn't matter if the snow is falling So 
Josh is home now, and one of the best things that we got, not best, but one of the fun things that we got this season was this advent calendar from Costco. It's just sitting in our closet because it's really big, and it comes with small bottles. So today is the 16th. Ooh, I think it's a red. Yay! It's a red. Cool. We're getting to the bottom of it, obviously, but... This has been really fun. I think we need to make it a tradition to get this every year. So this one was yesterday's, but we didn't have any wine yesterday. So this was yesterday's, which I just served. We're having Chipotle for dinner. And then this one is today's. So yay. Highly recommend if you like wine. It's been a lot of fun, right? Yeah, it's been good. Interesting. Yeah, a lot, a lot more whites and reds, but that's okay. It's been fun. It's gotten us out of our comfort zone. I think it's 50%. We've just been drinking a lot of the whites early. And oh. That might just be the lack of the job. Oh, also, I guess I'll show you this. Ignore all the dirty dishes. That's like the only thing I didn't clean. But we just bought a, um, like a fireplace kind of like mantle thing to go right there. I've been talking about it for honestly months. And I finally bit the bullet and bought it. So now we just have to assemble it, which is going to take a while. But if I could have anything for Christmas, that would be a nice present to get set up. How did the bullet taste? I'm trying to figure out how to zoom this in, but I haven't quite mastered that yet. I know, but there's a way to do it. There we go. I'm so close to your face now. <laughs> okay, so I just realized I had my camera on a really weird setting so I'm sitting here where I usually film my videos and to be honest I wasn't gonna share this and I really wish I could prop my camera on something because I'm just holding it right now but I went through I had like bags of Christmas stuff sitting here and it was honestly like getting overwhelming because I've just been like throwing things in this room this is our spare room our guest room and so I've just been like, whenever I buy Christmas gifts, I've been throwing them in here. And I just kind of like reorganized. I don't even know if I want to show you this, but I will. Um, here, this is where I'm hiding like all the gifts. So I do have them. These are just like bags. So down here, those are just like bags. But these are all the gifts that I've purchased that I've just been hiding because honestly nobody really comes in this room. Um, I use it mainly to film and then I always have the laundry sitting on the bed. Um, and then we have like our winter coats in here because Josh and I both went to school in a colder climate so we have a lot of good like winter gear but we live in Southern California. So like this room is like, I always wanted a room like this to be totally honest, like a catch all room. That's what this room is for us. So anyway, all the Christmas gifts are sitting there and I had had some of James's gifts just like out. So I wasn't letting him in this room because I had like that Coco Melon bus out. Like I had stuff out and I was like, I really don't want him to see that because like, you know, um, I don't want him to know what Santa is bringing for him. So um, anyway, I organized it. So now there's still bags. Do you want to see? This is embarrassing, but whatever. There's still bags of stuff. Like, I reorganized it. So those are, like, still gifts and, like, things. Those, yeah, some of these are, like, um, actually in that, like, yellow bag is my next few Lululemon hauls because I usually hang them on my clothing rack before I film them, but I haven't even, I haven't even opened them. Like, that's how busy it's been and I think a lot of it is like due to vlogmas which is totally fine but it's just been so busy so anyway I was the, the god I'm so talkative I'm so sorry but so James's main teacher I got her like this really cute gift basket um that was made at my high school but my high school does a um like a holiday event where the moms put together like gift baskets and then they sell them and obviously all the money goes to the school so i gave or i got one of those for james's main teacher so that has like it's really cute i should show you but i put it in the car already it has like hot chocolate and like cute little mix and it's just like really pretty because i feel like teachers get like they always get mugs and they always get like i don't know they just always get the same stuff so i just 
wanted to give them like practical things that were still like cute so that was his main teacher and then his teacher aide she is like probably 25 I don't know she's in her 20s so I'm giving her this black can't even see it next to my sweatshirt anthropology candle this is just the capri blue and I just think this is so pretty it's so just like aesthetically pleasing and I think anybody kind of like our age who knows anthropology would appreciate that so I think she'll really like that then I'm giving her this little um Lady Gaga house laboratories sunset eyeshadow palette it's really cute I think she'll like it she doesn't wear a lot of eyeshadow obviously like at school but um I have seen her like get dressed up occasionally and so I think she'll wear that with that I have the benefit roller lash which um I know she does wear mascara and then I just got her this moisturizing face mask so I think those are all for somebody in their 20s like she can light the candle she's got some makeup products and a fun little mask so and I mean like she's dealing with toddlers all day so I think that that's good and then for honestly there's this other teacher and I don't even know like I think she like subs in sometimes because she actually teaches the next grade but I am giving her this perfect Christmas candle and winter candy apple soap and a little cracking me up hand sanitizer so all these things are super practical and then for the director and the assistant director I'm giving them both a candle so I have under the Christmas tree and tis the season and then they're both getting a little hand sanitizer so here's one and then this is the other one and then they're both getting a L'Occitane hand cream because they're dealing with kids I know they're washing their hands all the time and I'm sure their hands are very dry so I tried to think of like cute festive gifts that were appropriate because like I said I I totally gave a different gift to the 20 year old than I did for like you know some of the older ladies so um I hope that they like them it's always really hard for teacher gifts um so I hope they like them that's what I'm putting together right now so I'll flip you around I'm just sitting here on the floor Josh has James in these are like soaps that I just recently got for our house and plugins I had them all in a bath and body bag but this is just like and then I did grab these from bath and body you can always ask them so I'm gonna put it in this cute bag and then I have these little two from and then I'm gonna wrap it with some paper um, and then those are for the other teacher so anyway that's what I'm doing right now it's almost nine o'clock I'm so tired and I was gonna check my work email so even though today was a day off I hate I absolutely hate having like a ton of work email to come back to but I may not get to it tonight I may get up early and read my email while I'm having coffee I don't know we'll see also I thought this video I was gonna have to carry it into the next day but I think this video is sufficient so after this I have one more vlog to film because I have sit down videos scheduled so my last vlog of vlogmas will be my family's Christmas party which is this coming weekend and my parents have been doing this for like Oh my god since the year they got married or the year before they got married they got married in 1989 so over 30 years my parents have done this Christmas party and last year our family couldn't go like Josh James and I because we had COVID so um I'm really excited I'll vlog that that'll be a lot of fun that's this weekend so I'll be sharing that sorry my arm's so tired um but that's the last vlog of vlogmas which is insane the rest will just be sit down videos to kind of like recap the year so thanks for watching thanks for sticking with me i hope you're enjoying it i'm really proud i've had a good time i'm gonna plan to do this every year now so you know i hope you like it and i'll wrap up this video because it's gotten way longer than i intended so i will see you in tomorrow's video